If you guys did enjoy this episode of the Bull Ring on the channel, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you are new, and don't forget to turn on the post notifications. That way you don't miss a single upload from me in the future. And if you want to see more of these, I will go ahead and say this. This is probably going to be like a random thing. Uh, this was done at like 3 o'clock in the morning. So we talked about a little bit of everything. If you guys want to see us talk about topics on the channel it's kind of a random thing but if you guys want to see us talk about topics on the channel let us know down in the comment section below and all I can say is enjoy Okay, and, and to, to be quite fair, like, I've just started, you know, like, I, I know there's a lot of things that everybody says, but if you hand me a Xbox controller, if I'm in an Xbox household, the first thing you will hear come out of my mouth or much less happen is this sound right here. You will hear that quick, fast, and in a hurry if somebody hands me an Xbox controller. Like, I mean, I'll play anything. And that's yeah, probably that's the... Yeah, I'll play it. That's like I said, it's all about the game. It's not really about the system. Yeah, and I mean, okay. Like me, e each... I started on uh, the payload. Yeah. The first game, major game system was the Xbox. I started with the Halo game. Yeah, and I mean, every everybody has different opinions. You know, like I said, you do have those people out yeah. there that are diehard PlayStation fans, and they won't yeah. they won't touch the Xbox for shit. Like they will not touch it at all. But then you got the people that are you know that play both sides of the fence, like us. That you know we grew up on different consoles. Yeah. So we know what it takes for both. You know, we look at it just like, just like Crazy said. Yeah. A system is a system. You hand me a controller, and I will play the crap out of it. If I don't know how to play it, I will learn how to play it. Yeah. The only reason I want to know the Xbox is so I can freaking play uh, Midnight Club the Remix. That's my favorite game of all time. Favorite game of all time. What, dub edition remix? Uh -huh. My thing is, is like, when it comes to, when it comes to, uh, when it comes to, like, I'm gonna buy me a new console here soon. But I determined, since I've got a PS4, there's no reason for me to buy an Xbox right now because the games I play are primarily on PS4. You know, not only that, but they're on both consoles. And since so I've what's got the point? This, yeah, so what's the point of having two Xbox. games on both consoles unless you're going to be doing a comparison video? And even then, yeah. it's going to be really tricky to do a comparison video yeah. because YouTube, like, okay, take for example, at this point, I'm recording, but I really don't care, like, what anybody says. Yeah. Just don't let it go too far because this is one of our bullpen sessions right here. This is yeah. where it's going to start, and we're going to see where it's going to go. But the biggest thing is when you look at it and you have both systems and you have, okay, take for example, I've got GTA on both systems, Xbox and PlayStation. To me, I've noticed a graphical difference, but is it a really big deal? No. That's like, okay, Fortnite, Fortnite, Fortnite. for prime example, we're going to throw Fortnite in this mix. Fortnite yeah. is available on PC, Xbox, PlayStation, and yeah. mobile. And Switch. Well, that counts as mobile, but yeah. Um, well, well, I yeah, I, I, I get I get what you're saying, but you know, there's really no point. Like, if you have games on different consoles, if you have the same games, there's no point because okay. Take for prime example with the Xbox. I started 
playing GTA on Xbox a couple months ago. What happened to me? I had to start all over. Like there was no transfer option. That's the biggest gripe I had. I wish I was able to transfer the stuff that I had on PlayStation over to Xbox. But unfortunately, because they're both right. next generation systems, it would not allow me to. Yeah. Uh, see, I've determined I'm getting a new console, and I've determined just because there's a lot of games on the Switch I want to play, like Zelda, shit like that. When I buy my next console, it's going to be a Switch, because right now, Xbox doesn't have any exclusive games that I'm really too worried about playing. Well, that's because, and, and it's another gripe about the exclusive games that I want to kind of bring to light here. A lot of exclusive games that Xbox has had or PlayStation that has had is not exclusive anymore. And that's just because of the simple fact and I, I you know I may be wrong for saying it and I might get chastised in the comment section for it. Yeah. But and it, it, a lot of it is uh, when the exclusives came out a lot of people wanted them on more than just that console. Take for example, Destiny, the first Destiny. When Destiny first came out, it was strictly PlayStation early access, which meant PlayStation got all the DLCs first. They got all the extra uh, content first. That's like, okay, well, when that started happening, People on the Xbox side started getting a little irritated because when Destiny finally came out for Xbox, they didn't get none of the early access stuff because Destiny had a contract already with Sony, or Bungie had a contract with Sony that allowed them to get all the early access content first. Okay. That's like Activision and Treyarch, same thing. PlayStation gets uh, DLCs for Black Ops a week before anybody else. And, and kind of playing off of that is the whole thing where... They did. Go ahead. They, I was going to say they did the same thing with the Red Dead, right? No. Because there was a early access with uh, just Red Dead on some of the system for, for PlayStation. No, for the, on, the only thing they did was Red Dead is not available on PC yet. That's the only thing oh, they did. Okay. But, I thought they had early access for like uh, the PlayStation and not the Xbox. What I, heard. Uh, I I can't but, remember but like, to be honest with you, but when the beta when the beta for Black Ops came out, Xbox didn't get the beta for Black Ops Four until like a month after PlayStation did. And then on top of that, where uh, going back to the Destiny thing, where yeah, Destiny One, the last DLC for Destiny One, which was uh, the Destiny with the freaking sniper rifle. I can't remember the last content title update for it. But PlayStation got it. And Bungie actually said Xbox would get it. To this day, Xbox has still not gotten that last content update for Destiny 1. Because they did not release it for Xbox. That's like... Uh... That's like, I think the only exclusive besides like the old games like Spyro and all that that they remastered, and hell, I even think they remastered that for Xbox. Um, that's like, to this day, the only still truly exclusive PlayStation game that started out exclusive and still exclusive that I can think of is God of War. That's the only one. That's the only one I don't think Xbox has yet. Um, well, that's Spider Man, but Spider Man, I'm not counting because it just. Spur of the oh yeah, yeah. Spider Man was like a spur of the moment thing, but it was still good. Um, yeah. but we're gonna kind of shift topics here a little bit. That way we're not like hovering around the Xbox PlayStation controversy, because I know there's gonna be a lot of that in the comment section when everybody hears what we're talking about. But the biggest thing I can say, console wise, is you know, like I said when. We before we started recording this because I kind of started recording yeah. midway, but you know everybody everybody will kind of get the, no everybody will kind of get the gist. But the systems themselves, every one of them has a flaw. Every one of them has a good you know good and bad thing about them. 
So yeah. what I'm gonna do is you've heard all of our comments here about what we what we found. This is your time in the comment section because as you guys are seeing this, this is probably gonna be later on in a couple weeks. But leave your thoughts and opinions in the comment section below. And please, 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 please be civil, as civil as you can. Because everybody here knows that we all have different opinions. And, you know, this is just a thing for you guys to come in and actually interact with us. To, you know, let us see what your ideas are. But what we're going to do is we're going to move into, like, a next topic and... I'm going to kind of let somebody rattle something off because I'm not really sure where to go from here. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> you never know. I can't really <laughs> you never know. Shut up. I'm an idiot. Okay? Yes, you I are. Know I'm an idiot. Yeah, you are. Um, oh, wow. I found a nicer way to get the online ID. Go to edit profile and you're dang on thing. Holy crap. Yeah. You could have done it that way. But, um,. Another thing, another thing, guys. Uh, while this video is being recorded, PlayStation just released. I think it was today. I think I think it was today. Yeah, yeah. It, uh, was. it was. PlayStation it was today, just yesterday. released either today or yesterday, as this is being recorded. Uh, which this is being recorded on a Thursday. Yeah. Um, the name change feature, which. Xbox has had for years. PlayStation just now released that for us to actually experiment with. I am going to say this just because of things we've noticed. It is a little glitchy right now and from what we can see is you can get your first name changed for free and it will not affect any of your account saved data and we just had somebody join the party. What? What? What's happening? Uh, Outlaw. Oh, Outlaw's here, and I'm in the middle. I'm in the middle of recording. Holy crap! But um, <laughs> if you guys have no shut up, Outlaw. Okay. If you have noticed the name change feature, um, oh. it is a little buggy right now because of the simple fact it is still being worked out. If you change it, you get your first name change for free. Anything after that is ten dollars. But don't worry, if you don't feel like paying the $10 right now, uh, you are able to get your name changed for free within the next 90 days of your first change. So if you don't like it, just stick around with it for like 90 days and it might grow on you. Hell, I don't know. But that's like, okay, uh, Skylon, who is Graveyard Gaming, has recently changed his gamer tag. Uh... Crazy Cobra, who is Offbeat Gaming, just recently changed his, as well as his other half, who's sitting in the party, par partially probably asleep. But um, yeah. the li a little, a little keyword, a key thing to notice: if you guys do change your gamer tags, do not worry about the ad symbol in the parties. Once you change your gamer tag, these people will still be on your list. So don't freak out. Don't. Don't blow your stuff up because you see the ad symbol. They are still on your friends list. It's just PlayStation needs to take the time to work out the bugs and kinks because of the simple fact this just did get released. So we're just as excited about it as you guys are. But to be honest with you, we all got to figure out where we're going to go because there's a couple people that have changed their gamer tags already that I can see they're not going to stick with that same name, so. I got one says my name. Oh, so you did, you, 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 know, whatever. You did, you, you did change yours to, uh, your YouTube? Yes. Yeah, my gamer tag is the same with my YouTube now. Oh, okay, cool. <sighs> yeah. Well, I mean, we've covered the freaking Xbox versus PlayStation controversy. We've covered the PlayStation name change. Um, What's about the new DLC? I, I hit, you know, 
I like I said, I hit record later on in the the bull. God dang. We started. Freaking dinosaur started up in this bitch. Wow. Oh man. Sorry. We, but we started but never finished our issues with Marvel. Yeah, like I hit record like way late in the bullpen session because we bounced in between two parties doing this and. Long story short, we came up with the issue, or the issue resolver with Marvel. All the crossovers, excellent. Just saying. Or not all of them, but most of them. Um, You're thinking the DC shows, bro. Yeah, yeah, it is early. It is early in the morning. Leave me alone. <laughs> um, <laughs> shut up. Uh, but anyway, the, okay. This is what we're going to do, just so you guys have a little input. What I want you to do for my comment section and for this video is I want you to leave your favorite one. And by doing that, we're either going to do hashtag Marvel or hashtag DC. That's what you guys should do in the comment section right now is hashtag Marvel or hashtag DC. And to be honest, to be honest with you, I want to see where that goes just as well as the PlayStation versus Xbox thing. Because I think that's now, just going to be just enough controversy right there. Uh, now, on the same note, because like like I said, a lot of people feel like the Marvel movies are better, but the DC TV shows are better. So if you are one of those, make sure you specify like yeah, Marvel like movie. Yeah, like if you do that, specify like ha do like hashtag both or... You know, or yeah, you, yeah, you, yeah, you, yeah, or hashtag Marvel, Marvel movie. movie, or if you don't want to do that, just put hashtag both and just be done with it. Cause I mean, yeah. a lot of people don't like to type a lot. And if I yeah. did not make the proper introductions, which I know I didn't, because we started recording halfway through this conversation, <laughs> we have Little Psych from Magnum Optimus Entertainment. Hello? Hello? Psych! Dang it, Psych! I think we lost him. He did say something to me before I joined the party about going to bed, so maybe he went to bed. Oh, he probably went to sleep then. Alright. We have Crazy Cobra from Offbeat Gaming. Back at it again with us. <laughs> he's there, but he's he's multitasking. And then we have um um is it Graveyard Gaming Skyline? Yeah, Graveyard we, Gaming on uh YouTube, Undead Gaming on Twitch. Now there you go, ladies and gentlemen. There's his plug. Um. Well, actually, Undead Gaming Entertainment on Twitch. I that swear to does, God. Which one? Pick one. Can't have both. <laughs> right. Oh, uh, but it's Sunday Gaming Entertainment, and on YouTube it's Graveyard Gaming. And then we have, oh, uh, yes. then we have our mutual friend, uh, Mr. Sean over there. He's hanging out with us for the bullpen this morning. Yeah. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> I think I'm about to invite Sean. Um, I'm and then we have, then we have the ever so non-filtered outlaw. Yeah. Okay, I gotta get there. I want to eat your heart with chocolate. Oh my god, outlaw, I swear to god. But anyway, like I said, I know I didn't make the proper introductions for everybody, and I do apologize. Like I said, we did hit record at a late date in this. But, not to make this video... it's three in the morning. Yeah, not to mention while this is being done, it's three in the morning. So it's, it's probably one of these... Uh, uh, last time well, it's four o'clock in the morning. Get your, get your story straight. Well, yeah, it is four o'clock. Okay, I, I, it's four o'clock for you, three o'clock for me. Shut okay. up, Skyline. <laughs> come to the future. <laughs> come to the future where it's better. Anyway, <laughs> come to the dark side. We have cookies. Oh. <laughs> hey, hey, JP, glad I'm not what I used to be, man. I'd be, I'd be uh three hours behind y'all. Yeah, yeah, true. Crazy. But anyway, you guys, not to make this video too long, if you enjoyed this portion of <laughs> the pen, 
Make sure to drop a like on this video. Go check out everybody's channels found in my description box down below. Make sure to go subscribe to them. Tell them I sent you. And hopefully we can do this again. Because yeah, this one was the first one. This is kind of like the pilot episode of the freaking bullpen. Yeah. So we're going to see how well it goes. And if it does go... Like, these are going to be spur of the moment. None of this is planned. It was just hit the button and go. So, yeah, it could... decided he was going to record. Yeah, it's it... just like this last time. Yeah, <laughs> shut up, outlaw. I swear to God. I'm going to beat Damn. the fuck. Mm. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, uh, you guys um, anywho, before oh, outlaw freaking causes me to freaking do something I don't want to do, um... If you guys did enjoy, make sure to like the video, subscribe if you're new, and if this is the first video you've seen from me, stay tuned for more content. If you want to see another episode of the of the pen, make sure to stick around because this is a spur of the moment thing. This is not a scheduled thing, so I don't know when the next one's gonna be. It's just whenever the button is hit to record. I mean, I mean if it Probably does, tomorrow, then, like, I mean, I'm sure it'll become a scheduled thing. You know? Yeah, if it, like it, it just depends on the topics we talk about. So, hopefully, you guys enjoyed, and we'll catch you guys in the next episode of the pen. Have a good morning, and stay tuned to the channel. Oh, God. <laughs>